people of Earth and everyone somewhere in between. Hey there, everyone. This is Al Cow, and today the Sonic real the gameplay story of Sonic, Sonic Adventure the begins. Uh, E101 version 2. No, we're done with the robot. This is only Sonic one guy Adventure. left on this radial character selection screen. Big the cat, big purple guy, eyeball like an owl, staring straight forward. They had a higher, a highly paid voice actor to do that voice work, obviously. <laughs> Look at those stars. Pretty sweet texture. Whoa! Something's fallen from the sky. Well, you wouldn't know from this house inside the jungle. Look at that. And he's got this cat sleeping on his wooden bed. He's got this his his bed warmer power up underneath, keeping him cool. Uh oh, a frog is distressed. Uh, he's gonna go investigate an earthquake. Here you go, frogaroo. Frogs are cool. Uh oh. Um, there's some kind of drip. It's gonna be rude. No, not my frog -o. Look at that, everything is brown because everything is the underside of a cat's shoe. Man, his theme is super rad though. You have to give him that. He's sleeping clutching to his fishing rod. He just loves to fish. I don't know why. He's got really spiky stuff of hair on his chest. It's like anime chest hair. Where is he? I can oh wow, he's way over there, lost in the texture. Yeah, he grew a tail. That's weird. He's like he went back to being a frog teenager. He says, not looking at the frog anymore. Hey, that's my magic gemstone. Yeah. What's wrong with you? Come back here. What's wrong so, with you? I could predict it. Something's not right. We've always been friends. For years. How is the sl slide whistle okay. part of the Why instrumentation? <laughs> Just okay. randomly going poof. <laughs> now we're in Station Square. <laughs> yeah. It's daytime. It took a while to get it here. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Oh man, where could my Pollywog pal be anyway? Awkward. Hi, I'm a giant cat. Sweet. As I can see, time itself. Oh, no, I wanted to strike with my stat. Yeah, there we go. That's right, and I can jump. So here on the side, this is Big the Cat. He squeals like a tire and stings like a bee. Uh, so his voice actor is John St. John, the voice of Duke Nukem. And I don't understand why. He was like, this is just a voice anyone can do! Like, it's you don't need a professional voice actor if that's what you're gonna end up with. Oh, well, wiggle the lure, huh? Yeah, so, uh, this might take a little bit, uh, to adjust to the gameplay here, because I forgot every single detail. Um... This might sound pretty scary with know-it-all kids says here. There's a place somewhere in the city where you can go down into oh the Oh boy, sea. we're going to sewer while I jump on cars. Uh, want to go to Twinkle Park? Oh, I can get stuck here. Like, there's a sewage entrance, like, around here, or am I thinking of somewhere else? No, it's right here. It's behind Twinkle Park. You gotta go in the sewer. You know, you just do. You know, a fro froggy friend would like to go in the water, and look at that. There's a power-up right here. Lure power up! Here we go! Bigger fish is mine! Eh. Can't go in there though. Oh no, the other sewer entrance, right? I remember, yeah, in the. in the uh, city hall area. There we go. No, so you can do it! Oh, the most powerful enemy, the slow. Like, this cat is giganto. This is one large kitty cat. Like, he's bigger than a car. 
And people are kind of okay with- Oh, look at that! There's a frog! Froggy! Stop making spoiling sounds at me. There you are. Anyone can do that voice. There's no effort coming up. Are you just gonna like kick this car out of the way? Is that why this path opens up in the future for other characters? And there's a cop right there. All right, well, I don't care. There we go. Whoop! Car's still there. All right, well, uh, I'm now in the sewer. But like another kind of sewer. Having fun. There might be stuff here. There's like a parking lot in the sewers. Park your car. Wow, I can like go. Whoa, there we go. Okay, so that might be the exit. But like I didn't get what I needed to get, I think. Like I don't think a frog can use a door. Like that's just one of those uh, scientific things. Just keep playing uh, Crash here. It's constantly going. Okay, no, I guess you go in the exit door. All right, but like you're just constantly going against the camera. Okay, maybe now, not anymore. Maybe yes, still. I don't know. Oh, this doesn't feel great. But hey, here we are. Go out this door. Yeah, I love doors. Uh, and, uh, now we're somewhere. Oh, what? We're in Twinkle Park. How do we end up here? Um, are we supposed to be here? Should I be worried? Should I contact some kind of technician? A very stinky cat just broke Welcome into Twinkle, Twinkle Park. Park. Uh, everyone panic. He has a weapon of some kind and he's facing to the side. Here we go, Twinkle Park. Uh, Fish for catch froggy. That's right. It's time for fishing. Somewhere in this thing is a frog, and you gotta catch him with your rod. Completely forgot how this gameplay here works. Like, just completely forgot. You can get rings, and you can destroy a monkey with your fishing rod. So you pull this. You can aim. Okay. So you can tug it around a little bit. Okay. Hey. You want that? You want that fish? I don't know, man. Uh, I can't help- Oh! So then I press buttons? Like I'm holding down a button and I'm trying to turn my line here. I don't know if I'm doing the right thing or not. I'm just kind of swiveling it and I, I, I'm holding uh, the attack button. Uh, as we can see, Cat is having a normal up there. <laughs> just, yeah, that's how you fish if you're being energetic about it. Shonen Hunt Fishing Zone. Here we go. I'm probably doing wrong buttons. Like, that's the reality. I yeah! I got, I got almost kilogram deep fish. But yeah, so we do that, but with our frog friend that I can't see. Is that him over there? Like, like the first challenge is figuring out where he is. Okay, I can change the camera with the D-pad. Once. No, that's a green fish. I'm just gonna turn around looking for my frog friend. I don't think he exists in this lake. Hey, the fish! Something's biting! Look at that texture on that fisho. I'm just... Oh, he's stronger than me, or I still don't understand what you're supposed to do. It's all very possible. Like, the controls would normally be explained in the... in the manual. This is still in the era of manuals, after all. But the frog... I don't know if the frog moves around a lot, or if he's always gonna be, like, in that corner. I don't know. So yeah, right now I'm holding the jump button, and I'm swiveling my uh, control stick uh, in circles, like if I was fishing in real life. Uh, you'll button and swivel, man. My thumb is not a fan of this high intensity activity, but it's okay. We all live this way. That, that's not true. I mean, maybe you do. I got a yeah, fish. I got a fish! Alright, look at that. Instead of a timer, we got a weight counter. Like, it's telling that we don't have a timer, I feel like. The game is trying to tell you something. Alright, like, he was, like, around here-ish, right? 
let's just drop the water here and see what happens. There's a big old fish. I'm turning the camera up or moving the lure around. I'm not sure. Yeah, there it's not very deep. Like, I just need to figure out where he is. I don't want you. No. No! Oh, frog's over there. He's more like in the middle. No! No! I don't- something's Well, biting. I got something's biting. So, uh, how do you edit this? <laughs> Look, man, maybe we should just take a chill. That line is just cutting through that fish. It's gonna be bleeding everywhere. At that point, it's just kind of suffering. And now I'm bashing its face against the wall of the pool. But then I lost him? Not sure what happened. So, can I see it? Yeah, it's like over there. Froggy, where are you at? I don't have any bait, it's just a lure. Well, so I thought I could move it in the other direction, but no matter how I'm moving my D-pad, it's going in the same way. Where are you? Hey, Froggy! Frog, look, I'm gonna do a little froggy dance for you. Froggy! Man, the speedrun of this part must be magnificent. Alright, hey, Froggy! Froggy, look! It's your favorite toy! Look! Doesn't it look appetizing? It sure- Oh shoot. You didn't bite. No, I don't want you! I want Froggy! Where is he now? Froggy, don't abandon me. Um, yeah, I don't know where it is. Gonna tap, tap. Like, I don't know if he does, like, rounds in the same places, or... I want you fish. Get out of here. Well, oh, so yeah. You see how my line is getting all red? Uh, if it, if the meter goes all the way full, it uh, my line will snap. Like I don't lose a life or anything. I don't think. I don't remember. Maybe I do. But but that's like the strength of my line basically, and it can snap, and that does make people sad. Oh, look at that. Now we're just dragging this poor fish on the land. It's gonna be hurt. I got it. Uh, I got it. Whoa, that fish is huge, though. Alright. Where's that frog now? Where are you gone, froggy? Okay, you still yeah, in the same area. I don't want you, big dug. I want froggy. Hey, froggy. No! Something's biting. Ugh, something's biting. Look at the teeth on this thing. And it's not a robot fish, it's a real, just, organic animal that I guess we're gonna eat once the level is over. <laughs> I mean, I guess we can see it that way. It's just, uh, a slice of life adventure. And see, now I don't know why it went all police siren and the fish was going away. Maybe I'm doing something that I'm not supposed to. I am not doing something I'm supposed to. It's all extremely possible. I just don't remember it looking so goofy, but... <laughs> Maybe it is. <laughs> that, that fish. And that cat. They're all fairly large. See, he's a large cat. That's why his name is Big. It's the same way that, you know, God, Sonic makes big. sounds. That's why he's named Sonic. And Tails has a gambling addiction. That's why he's called Tails. Hi, right, frog. Frog, look! There's a lure right here. Ooh, does it not look delicious, frog? No! No, it does not look delicious, fish! It doesn't! Stop lying to yourself. Maybe at some point, I'm gonna get rid of all the fish in the pond, and no one's gonna be left, so I'll be able to just get my frog pal. That's the plan. Alright, wonderful plan. It's going to work. I'm looking forward to it. I remember the scrolling of that, like, the, the, the lever thing to be more always round. This could be an emulation thing. Or like, you know, like, I'm not playing with the Dreamcast controller, right? So it's possible that it's really, like, tailor-made for the Dreamcast analog oh, stick. Fish. Oh, that fish is tiny. Alright, let's change our location a little bit. Okay, I can see the frog. I want to land in front of it a little bit so it sees it. It's like, whoa, it's a pink thing. 
gross. Look at this pink thing, Froggy. No? Alright. Not close enough then. Is there like an express? Yeah, if you hold both jump and the turn. So if I poof it all the way here, and like I just kinda wait for it to return. Ah, oh, yeah, see, now he's into it. No, why'd you let go? Why'd you let go? You're not, you're not, you're not keeping it. Like, fish are really good at keeping it. Keeping it real. Yeah! There we go. There we go. There we go. We caught. Oh, man. So, like, that means, like, stopping so violent with your line, I guess. But why is this frog so powerful with my line compared? Well, I mean, he is now uh, powered by a Chaos Emerald. Like, I didn't take that into consideration. This is accurate. So I keep the button to hold, but I just stop rotating my line when it gets, like, very intense. Yeah! We did a 500 gram frog! Is that big for a frog? I don't know a lot about, uh, frog. Yeah! We're gonna get the long videos now! Not too bad. I don't know how I'm gonna edit this. Like, I genuinely- Do I just leave it all in? I guess as long- I don't know. Maybe for this first one. We'll see well, for the future. Alright, well we did it. We beat a level. We got a froggy. Story's over! And they say cute couples come free, so there we go! It even has a happy ending. We can go on the roller coaster.